Okay, good days everyone. Today I want to share about this. Okay, because I quite long time I didn't post my video, but now I want to try. I because I'm testing this kind of thing. Okay, because uh, you are do some of our customer request we have a sell for MP and MPI intelligent entrance video units. Okay, this is an MP MPI camera. So this MPI camera is quite useful. So we can detect the all the number plate. Okay, I'm just want to say I'm from Malaysia. You know our Malaysia the number plate is quite a uh, specific so today i want to talk, talk about this okay first we have to assess we uh, today i want the video i this is the whole project so this is one of my video this is how we activate the cameras and how we program the cameras okay so first of all we have to uh, activate the camera first okay we using back our satp tools we res, uh, we activate the camera as usual that are uh, like how we activate other cameras up okay so we say we set back the IP, IP address I think this is not so important. Okay, the important part is over here. Okay, we prefer using IE to access on it. So we use IE to access the IP address. Okay, once it, uh, we, we enter the username and password. Okay, this is the layout. This I using the way because I don't want to install outside, so I use my other camera to view. Okay, so over here, one thing we have to do is go into the quick configurations. No, we one thing we have to do one thing first. We have to go into the device parameter. Okay, configurations. Okay, we go into this uh device configuration under the uh the under the capture parameters. Okay, capture parameters over here. You, if you from other country, if you from other country, if you from other country, you have to ensure this country is correct or not. Because the sound of uh, using a Euro, Euro country and so on, so you have to talk to your HIK Vision people. You need a specific format to run in your country. So this uh, is from my place. I using Asia Pacific and the front and back place. Okay, we save it. Okay, and also we have to do the. Uh, we have to do the quick configuration. Okay, quick configuration over here. We only need to do image adjustment only over here. Okay, lane is depend. This is your right lane and your left lane. So we have to configure like that. Okay, and this we also configure like here. So this is a trigger camera. So trigger lane, we put it in the center. Because once the vehicle go through the center, they will detect it as a number plate. Okay, so we complete it. Okay, done. So another thing is because this is for another setting. Okay, we're going to configuration. That's for entrance exit. Okay, this entrance exit depends of your site. Okay, if you're running camera only, you can use my camera. So it's not a lot and bad list you can upload over here. But if you're using your HIK, HCP system, that means it's using HIK Central Professional. Yes, you over here, you have to turn to be by platforms. Okay, depends what you need. Ah. Okay, so my, but my, I'm using this for the project for running HCP. So that I will, how to do the on the HCP side. So or eventually I need to use platform. Okay, done ready. We're going back to a real time picture so we can monitor over here. So in this is uh actually the how the system settings there's uh, not much setting over here can do. Whereas meanwhile I waiting the video, waiting the number plate come in. We just wait. Uh. Alright, they have a vehicle coming. Okay, you see it go through the triggering, it will pop up. Okay, this is a WG8979. Okay, WPG, this is how we capture the things. Uh. Okay, 
This is how we configure the MPR camera and how we activate it. Okay, thank you for watching. I will post my another video regarding the how we add this into the MVR and also into the HCP. Okay, thank you for watching.